We're in Calgary Northwest today. Uh, we're just going to be doing this video today. This is a very extreme EMF radiation zone here. We're going to get to the source of it. It's very troubling. But this is within the inner city of Calgary. Uh, we're kind of uh, just outside the downtown zone. And you can see uh, there's a the downtown there. You can see the buildings. And we got a lot, a lot of residences here. We're at the school today. I'm 16th here. Yep. And then we're going to head this way. We're going to do some readings, but there's some, um, this is a real serious extreme EMF radiation. So we're going to raise awareness today. And, you know, I should preface this NCA is not against new technology. But we put our health, the health of the Canadians, the privacy of the Canadians first. With this 5G rollout and the AI that's coming, it's going to create a totalitarian surveillance state. Our privacy is going to be completely gone. We don't even have a lot right now, as, as most people know, but it'll be completely wiped out. We'll be living in a, a totalitarian technocracy. And then we got all the health issues. The EMF right now with 3G, 4G is pretty extreme. So what what you normally get is headaches. Uh, you get you can feel dizzy, insomnia. Uh, you may have nausea. You may even throw up from it. But then you have internal biological effects, which has been shown by independent science. And this is a cumulative over over it could be 20, 30, 40 years. You end up getting cancer. You can uh, get blood disorders, oxidative stress, cell death, etc., etc. But with the 5G, it's going to it's going to take the cumulative effect, and we think it's going to reduce it. So instead of being 20, 30 years, it might be 10 years before you get cancer. That's how serious this stuff is, because it's going to increase the mass exposure of the, of the EMF radius and it's going to be at higher frequency. So let's get to the real results here. We're going to do a reading here. We got those trees there. So we're in a pretty extreme zone right now. It's at 3 3.50 3.64 peaking out. This is well above the adverse health effects for EMF radiation non-thermal. 3.65 just in the schoolyard with these look right there some kids are playing right now so this is already in an as adverse health effects on the non-thermal side we're up to a thousand microwatts per meter it's quite a bit yeah that's at the threshold for a public area according to the bio initiative 2012 let's move a bit closer There's some pretty disgusting uh, cellular towers we're going to show you now. A lot of people don't know that they're there, but we're going to expose them today. We'll get a reading from this playground now. See what's going on. Try not to film the kid, just to protect their privacy. Yep. We're at Balmoral School, and this is the playground. Okay. okay. We're going to go up to that monstrosity there, but you might as well zoom into it now just to show people. That's one of the sources of the, the sickening EMF radiation now that the, that the corrupt media doesn't want to expose. And, and then we got the establishment politicians who are just puppet distractions, really pathetic. But we're exposing it. Uh, and there's the, the second source. That's a senior's home. It's just flooded with uh, 4G and 5G antennas. That's the red building back yeah. there. Red or brown, whatever you want to call it. And they've actually painted uh, the, some of the antennas to blend into the... To the building. The building, so, yeah. so people aren't aware. Let's, let's do a reading here. Okay. Oh my God, this thing is... This it's thing is six. complete. 
Oh, it's completely maxed out in this in this playground. In this is uh, this is the stops going on not only in Canada but throughout the world. We're we're in contact with people from the U.S., people in Finland, uh, other parts of Europe, Australia. But look, this is a playground and it's completely maxed out. It's sickening. It's look disgusting. At look at that. The the micro watts per square meter. We're up to fifteen thousand. Yeah, I'm thermal it. effect. This is completely, absolutely maxed out from those two towers. These kids are getting radiated, unbelievably. Yeah. Oh my God! You hear the sound there? Yep. Look at that! Look at Turn that, up. everyone! focus these people are sick yeah the people who are doing it who are denying it this is a radiation pit right here this playground for these young kids it really is it's quite sad I, this thing is maxed you hear the sound yeah and it's pulsating too which is causing more biological effect mm -hmm. let's keep moving This is actually a senior citizen's home, and on the front of it is like a mega tower of 5G and 4G. It's pretty disgusting. Yeah, it's, it's just completely maxed out the meter. Yeah. And remember everyone, this is blanket radiation. This isn't just a, a signal coming at you. This is like head to toe, completely maxed out EMF radiation. Independent science, remember what we said at the beginning, there is a cumulative effect. And with the 5G coming out, it's only going to get worse. Yep. This is completely maxed out the meter. It's stuck at six. This is stuck at six. Yep. It's we, probably uh, higher. Let's, let's go through here. Yep. I want to go up to that second tower. It's pretty, pretty disturbing, and then we'll get some more insight into who's behind it. Yep. That one there. We'll turn the seniors one out a bit closer. You can see the downtown. We're fairly close. Yeah. You see the downtown in the background. Yeah, it's completely maxed out. Oh this, my gosh, it's not even... It's yeah, not even it's moving. stuck at six. It's, it, which means it's actually above six. Yeah. So this is just a extreme EMF radiation zone. This is cool. So this tower up here, the seniors goes right, right around, doesn't it? Yep. Yep. I think it's important to uh, film the front of it. Oh, so we'll go. So we'll go around to the front, and then we're gonna head over to there. You won't believe that site. That's um. Can you zoom in there? I just wanna. Yeah. You see the antennas, the lower antennas there. Yeah. Those are five G. Yeah. See the short little. Uh, the short little boxes. Yeah, those are five G there. Yeah. On that. See, we're working so people know there's a power installation here. Yep. You see this? Yeah, this is NMAX. But yeah. the meter doesn't pick up electrical uh, frequency. That's a good note. It doesn't pick up magnetic frequency. It's only picking up EMF from cellular. Just remember that. This is not influencing the readings, but obviously there's, there's some concern for the residents with this thing. Yeah. Additional concern. It's funny 
how they painted them that blend them in, eh? Yeah, it is. Look, it's like they're trying to hide, cover up, eh? Yeah, it's not obvious. <laughs> I feel bad for the people living here, man. This is so extreme. Mm hmm This is one of the most extreme zones in Calgary right now. It really is. Yeah. Should we walk up front? Yeah, I Kay. think so. Okay. Is that is that where you said to take a look, eh? Yeah. All right. And then I want to show that other side. It's pretty interesting. Is that tower yeah, there's, again? There's the 5G. Yeah. Three of them. Those short little uh, stubby antennas there at the bottom. Yeah, those three little boxes right those there. Are, those are 5G. Yep. because we're under the antennas. Yeah. You see that? Yeah. It's still an extreme, but it's it, it's dropped a bit because you're under the antennas, right? Yeah. You know. So they're up there just zoom in there so yeah yeah so one on this there. corner there for a bit so people can see it it's pretty crazy and then we have another over okay. here on the right side yeah pretty nasty stuff and that's all around that thing yeah this whole building is surrounded but just to know, we're, we're actually under the antenna, so right here is probably safer than across the street. Yeah. We're at 2.57 max on the meter. 3.32, 4.7. Yeah. It's still high, Yeah. but it's not maxing out. But over there, look, if you go that way, 5.22. To that monstrosity over there you yeah. see that yeah it's pulsating yeah it's pulsating yeah let's head over there i want we got to just go inside. all right you want to cross here walk down probably cross here yeah yeah, yeah. you see any more towers no That's China, that's heading into Chinatown there. Yeah. Not yet. I know there's an antenna just up here too, we can't see it. There's a, there's a gas station with a really nasty antenna up there. There it is, that's okay. fine. Get a better view yeah just hold it up there so people can see them so yeah. it's literally around this thing this whole building is just surrounded oh and there's a camera on the traffic nice where there's a camera on the traffic post right there oh yeah i see it yeah, yeah. this whole intersection is actually has cameras on it 
It's yeah, AI coming. Oh, look at that there too. AI coming to a city. What look is that? that? Look at that. What is this guy? Is that look. 5G? That's a Wi-Fi thing. Oh. Right there. And there's a camera up above. Yeah. Yeah. Gross. I wonder if that's facial recognition that camera. It very well could be. Yeah. Three three point four nine. Okay, so not terrible. No, but, but it's it, not no, good. But it, no, but it's well into the extreme extreme levels. Yeah. Point uh, you know four four point three five maxing out, so it's pretty high. Okay, let's keep walking. You know the the bad thing that what's going on is the person who owns that building is benefiting financially from contaminating the whole area. Yeah, meanwhile they're killing people and giving them cancer. Yeah, but he's benefiting. So, and the system's been rigged so there's no liability for the telecommunication. That's something NCA wants to change. We believe they should be liable. Yep. You know, one a one a one good strategy would be to boycott places like that. If I you're agree. gonna put up antennas, don't 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 lease a space there. Don't rent a space there. It's right? probably for lease for a reason. You know, if they're gonna contaminate the neighborhood, people shouldn't be renting their space. The playground was That's insane. Sick. That's sick. And there was that stupid liberal petition that we did a post on our blog, National Citizens Alliance, on our Facebook and National Citizens Alliance. That liberal MP, McKinnon, he threw everyone under the bus. He said he wasn't supporting it anyway. He was just doing it to appease people. Gross. And then he just threw them under the bus. Yeah, there's the full... What's that thing on the... That's pretty strange, right? That light on the lamppost? The top thing, yeah. Yeah. We'll have to... It's weird. We'll have to keep monitoring this stuff. Yeah. Yeah, I guess Canadians are pretty lazy. They don't want to do anything and they prefer to get cancer, says Alexandre. Yeah. You max? Yeah, yeah, it's, it's pretty much maxed out. It was it was actually slightly worse in the playground because Just hold it for a sec. Yeah. Look at that. Unbelievable. Pulsating. Yeah. Yeah. It's maxing out at six. But I, I thought the playground was just slightly worse because it was more in line of travel than in tennis. Yeah. It's still really bad. Mm -hmm. You hear the sound, everyone? Uh, that's how you can determine the level of radiation as well. Look at that. Basically, an extreme rate EMF radiation zone. They don't even know it. Yeah. You know, it'd be interesting to find out the cancer rate in this area. Uh, I bet you there's a lot of people who are having trouble sleeping. They're probably getting a lot of headaches. Yeah. What about kids? You know, apparently there's learning disorders. 
there's uh, psychological, psychiatric issues with this stuff as well. What What is the purpose of having all these towers so close again? Someone in the comments is asking. I thought well, the towers the were good. Is, uh, with the with the AI world, they want to create a, a continuum. They don't want to have break the connections. Yeah, so because yeah. uh, because this will facilitate AI, self-driving cars, robots, and they can't have the connection breaking because then they won't work. Yeah. So they have to have complete continuous uh, connection, right? Imagine a self-driving car, and then all of a sudden the connection stops. What's going to happen? That self-driving car no longer self-driving. Well, so. it could crash or something, yeah. right? Or just stop in the middle of the road. Yeah. Oh so, my gosh, look at all this stuff yeah, on here. Yeah, so that's why wow. I there. Can you zoom in so people can see? Yeah. Those three uh, lower antennas are 5G. Yeah. And then there's even more like 5G towers as you go up. Well, I think those are 4G above. But, but there's even smaller boxes up top too. But I, I think they're just connected to those 4G. Yeah. But those three uh, antennas below are definitely 5G. Yeah, these ones. They're probably uh, uh, 2.8 gigahertz to 3.5 gigahertz. Right there. Yeah. Are you maxed? It's down a bit because we're under under the yeah the, we're under the, the range. The travel. But look, it's still peaking at six. Oh yeah, I see that. Look at the screen. But look, at, it's around. It's going up to uh, over over five thousand microwatts per per square meter. Yeah. Which is well above the public acceptable level. People, looks like they have an air component at the back. You see the the kind of like a like a, fan? a filter a filter fan thing yeah. there. It means they're air cooled. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Panda panel antennas. Telus parking. Look at this. Look at that. Look at this. Telus. Look at this. Look at those coming into it. All the conduit and Look, electrical. But going right into the building. Yeah. And they have a warning sign. Yeah. Let's go around to the front as well. But you see that, one, right? That's this generator right here. mode. Can you, can you, so people can see that? Yeah. Someone ripped off the radio frequency. Warning. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's interesting. Yeah. Yeah. Let's go around to the front. It's so deceptive, isn't it? Very deceptive. Who would have thought this was a Dallas building? Yeah. Right in the heart of the residential community. It's raiding the, the kids' playground. That whole school over here. That's where the school was. Yeah. See that bell tower? That's where the school was. Under the thing, and, it, and this thing is just pulsating like crazy. Look at that. Up, down, up, down. Yeah, and it's up to nearly six, but it's worse at the playground because you're fully in line of travel. Yeah. Four residents are going look at to be that. You know, there's kids over there playing. Yeah. Look at that. Look at that. It's crazy. And they're just getting. Yeah. This is kind of like a, uh, a hidden having... danger. You know, I I can feel it in my head. I feel like there's a clamp on my head right now. But uh, uh, unless you're aware, you're you're just going to go on with things, and then you're going to end up with cancer someday, and they're going to blame it on something. You know, they'll probably say it's cold now. Yeah. Is there any other questions from the people? Um.
what was beside them, eh? If only they knew. Yeah. Right? It's a climbing club. Yeah. Yeah, I don't see any more questions. They're all... Well, there it is, there. And this building doesn't even look like a TELUS building. There it is, there. Look. You see the t tower? Yeah. It's, it's basically maxed out. It's it's not as high as the playground, which was completely over the top. Yeah. But it's pretty damn high. But it's going, got quite the range on it. Yeah, we're going up to 10,000 even. We're in Calgary. Yeah. Look at this. Unbelievable. It's maxing out at six. It's pulsating up to six. You see it there? Yeah, I see it pulsating up there. That's sickening, yeah. man. Mm -hmm. Look at the people living here. Every day, they're they're just getting. This is going into them. Yeah, you know, this is actually like a really nice community, and it's sad that people are just getting radiated, and they don't even know. Who would have thought, right? Yeah, who would have thought this building is not your normal Telus building? But there it is, right on the front. This whole community yeah it's just uh extreme emf radiation zone this is one example of what's happening to uh throughout canada and throughout the world so please share the message today everyone this is very serious stuff uh it's well documented in independent science we did the measurements this is objective information we measured it well into the extreme this thing was maxed out in the playground today. This is wrong, what's going on. All, all we can ask, like I said, please share the message.